In today's video we will see how to grow the green eggplant. The green eggplant is a crunchier and creamier cousin of the regular eggplant and is known by different names as you can see here. So we've planted some of these green eggplants on the ground on the raised beds with some supports and we also have some growing in a container. Now there are two types of containers we used. This one is a 16 inch wide, 16 inch high container with some uh, regular potting mix. This is a whiskey barrel container which can hold at least two plants, maybe three. So for this whiskey barrel container we created our own potting mix using the proportions as shown on the screen and this creates a low cost potting mix that's really good and very effective for your plants and you can do it for a very low price. So these seedlings had been growing in the greenhouse for about four weeks before I transplanted them. Now tomatoes and eggplants are very easy to transplant unlike other plants like beans which hate transplanting and must be sown directly. Tomatoes and eggplants can be started indoors much ahead of their growing season. And as you can see here we've added this soaker hose drip irrigation line and this should keep the plant evenly watered throughout the growing season. So within a few days you can see that the plants have really taken off and growing really well. And this one's the one that's growing on the ground. Now about a month after transplanting the plant it should have grown pretty tall at least about a foot or so and it now looks pretty healthy. The one in the container has taken off even better growing much better creating very healthy leaves and I did support these eggplants using this trellis and if you want to know more about the trellis you can watch the video on your screen. Now once the flowers appear you can pollinate these manually with your own hands just like that. But I've seen that this eggplant variety is very good in pollinating itself. And as we see this eggplant has grown pretty well pretty big for harvest so let's go ahead and harvest this eggplant. So that eggplant looks pretty good as you can see. It has a lot of thorns. The whole plant itself has a lot of thorns but uh, if you look at this eggplant it's pretty nice. No signs of any insects or diseases. The thorns also do a great job of keeping the loopers away, the soft bodies insects away. And you can see one more eggplant right here. The green eggplant is really good looking with the green and white distinctive look. So let's go ahead and harvest this other eggplant. And another one. Just look at the number of thorns on that eggplant. It's quite a lot. So I now have a couple of eggplants here that we harvested. And what I wanted to show you was how they look like from the inside. I know a lot of you have asked this question about how do these vegetables look like from the inside. So let's go ahead and cut it open. And this is also a good time to give you a tip about when to harvest eggplant. First let's cut this eggplant open and let me show you how the seeds in the eggplant look like. So if you can see these are white seeds. They haven't turned black yet. Now when the eggplant seeds turn black, that means you've waited too long to harvest the eggplant. You've got to harvest it before that. This is a perfect eggplant. The flesh of the eggplant looks pretty good. The seeds are white. It's perfect. And this eggplant will keep producing eggplants. It's now end of October here in California and my green eggplants are still producing a lot of eggplants. 
So out of all the other varieties of eggplants that are growing, the green eggplant is producing the biggest eggplants. Although the temperatures are quite low here now in Southern California. So I hope you liked this video. If you did not know about growing green eggplants, I am hoping this video helped you and I'm sure this will be a great addition to the varieties of eggplants you're growing. The green eggplant has a nice crunchy skin and also a very creamy flavor. So I'm sure you'll enjoy growing and eating it. I'll see you again soon. Happy gardening.